today I'm going to do an unboxing and a comparison. So, a, a few weeks ago you saw me unbox this bad boy. This is the Philips Sonicare connected with Bluetooth. And so there's an app on my phone that I can use and you see that it has clean mode, white mode, and a deep clean mode and it gives extra time for focusing on problem areas and you can adjust those with this and you can adjust the inten intensity of the brushing motion with that and then to turn it and the battery life is down here indicated and you turn it on here this has that head on it right now and it is a side to side motion so the bristles go like this really fast in your mouth and today we had a learning session with Coral B and they sent us home with these. This is the Oral B Awesome Top of the Line Pro 5000 out of the box. It comes and we're going to look at the difference. Why I open this? For those of you who don't know, I am in dental hygiene school. I'm a dental hygienist who works with a dentist as a prevention specialist. So a dentist definitely is a restorative specialist, and a dental hygienist is a preventative specialist. So we keep your teeth, your gums, your oral cavity, so everything inside your mouth in tip-top shape and whip it back into shape if you let it get out of shape. So anyways, back to the Oral-B. So, let's pull it out of the box. It has different heads to use with it. Comes to the base as a head holder. A cover for them, for the heads. They, I guess they clean, accessible, and ventilated. This is the charging kit. This is similar, similar looking charging base. the head clips right in there put them into place and there's the base of the brush so you put it on there and let it charge And the last thing it has is a travel case. So you can take the brush and put it that way. 
the brush and two heads fit in it on either side. I think it quite ruined in row. Now, that diff here, you know what I mean? Okay. I'm going to put the, one of the heads on it. So when we turn them off, the base is the Phillips Formal Care is also taller, about a centimeter taller. Most of that is due to the shape of the head on the nose. Let's see. Nope. This is a small shaped head for the Royal B Pro 5000, is the same height as the Rexus here. So, I'm going to charge up this new brush that I just got, the Oral-B Pro 5000, and try it out for a bit. It, it has been boasted as the toothbrush that most dentists use worldwide, and that is probably because of different research that has stated in the results that an, a rotating or oscillating head reaches more surface area of the tooth. So it cleans more of your tooth and of all of your teeth than a side-to-side -side motion head like the Philips Sonicare has. So I want to see how clean I feel using this one, because I've used this one for a few weeks now, and then maybe I will sit down and give you my personal results, or my opinion, from both of these. So they are both uh, inductively charged, so put them on this base, and the base has, both of the bases have a little piece coming out but really it's only to hold the, the base of the brush in place so it doesn't fall over because there are no cables, it's totally sealed. And it's waterproof, etc. For joining me. Now I've got some toothbrushes to uh, tell you about. Maybe I'll just brush twice as fast. Probably not. But if I do, I'll have to make a video about it, huh? All right. If you have tried either of these or both of these and have specific comments about them, please let me know which one you prefer and why. And also, please subscribe and like and all of that stuff. Thanks for taking the time.